citizens. Happy Inauguration Day. I'm Ken Cal for Game Day Preview presented by Comerica Bank. Tonight, the Red Wings, they're shuffling off the Buffalo to take on the Sabres. Detroit came from behind to defeat the Boston Bruins 6-5 in a shootout on Wednesday. Tomas Tatar had a goal and two assists. Thomas Vanek and Franz Nielsen scored for the Wings in the shootout. Thrown out in front again, Larkin, side of the net, and score! Nyquist, tie game! Must score. Does not! The Red Wings win it! Henrik Zetterberg and Thomas Vanek lead the team in scoring with 31 points. Detroit has 46 points on the season. They're six points behind the second place Senators and third place Boston Bruins in the Atlantic Division. I think it's just the fit, you know, I think um, everywhere, I think every team plays a little bit different. And, uh, again, I think for me, it's, it's, it's been a good situation. I've said it, you know, even after uh, I left Mini, I think I'm, I can still play in this league and um, play at a high level and be effective. I mean, you know, I talked to a few teams and Detroit is one of them that, you know, kind of saw me as a good fit. And, uh, so far, so good. You really want yeah, we can't get too comfortable though. Um, we have to you know, continue to, to work hard and we have to continue to play the way we've been, we've been playing and, and make sure that you know, we don't get, uh, we're not satisfied with the position we we're in now because uh, it's nowhere near where we want to be. Also, fans, there's a good chance that Darren Helm could be in the lineup tonight. Yeah, I'm excited. It's been, uh, it's been way too long um, just watching every game and you know, feeling like I can be out there, be part of the team, and uh, you know, obviously that's what I want to be doing. So, uh, excited to uh, finally get an opportunity to get back out there, and looking forward to it. The Buffalo Sabres, they dropped the 4-3 decision to the Toronto Maple Leafs in their last outing. Anders Nilsson will be between the pipes for the Sabres tonight. Kyle Oposo leads the team in scoring with 29 points. Fans keep an eye on Rasmus Ristolainen, who always seems to put up numbers against Detroit. Yeah, I was just talking to Thomas Vanek about uh, Ennis today, and then he was just saying uh, the amount of respect he had for him as a player, and that he, you know he thinks he's underrated uh, across the across the league a little bit. Um, you know, I've known Tyler a long time uh, as a, just from afar, uh, and had lots of respect for his game. And you know, he brings speed. He also brings lots of creativity, lots of vision. Just a real good offensive player who who seems to be complete. So certainly, you know, he's a guy they've been missing that I think brings lots to their Puck drop tonight is at 7 p.m. You can watch the game on Fox Sports Detroit with Ken Daniels and Mickey Redman or on the Fox Sports Go app. You can also listen to all the action on 97 Won the Ticket with Paul Woods and me. So in closing on this Inauguration Day 2017, all I have to say to you hockey fans is, in the words of that famous broadcaster, Mike Raffone, ask not what your hockey team can do for you, but what you can do for your hockey team. Happy Inauguration Day, everybody. Go Wings.